name is Marie Bryan and I also go by the name The Cotton Floozy. Tonight at West Elm I am teaching beginners of embroidery so you can come in with zero skills and I can help you learn just the basic stitches like a back stitch and a pedal stitch and a French knot and from that you can create your own hoops and pillows and anything you want to stitch. As soon as you have that one skill you can do hundreds of things with it. I began my craft recently, um, well I really began it um, when I was a child and my mom taught me how to do it and I uh, did not like to do it and I was probably pretty stinky about it and then I just swore off all crafts for about 10 years. And then my friends started a stitch and bitch group and I finally figured out something that I could do. I could fix my daughter's jeans because they had holes in their knees so I could uh, make patches and then I was like suddenly stitching like flowers over them and stuff. Whoa, I'm stitching flowers. Uh, what is happening? From that point on I wanted to do snarky embroidery. I got involved with uh, the DIY Fest Craft Lake City. There were, there were funny different uh, twists on all the traditional crafts and it seemed like that was what I wanted to do. So I applied and I made it in and it was just really my first experience selling at a booth and watching people laugh at my embroideries and it was just a real sense of pride that I never really had in anything I'd done before. And I, and I found so many friends, e even just through Craft Lake City, just people that came and visited me and shared the same snarky sense of humor that I had. It was just an immediate connection to, to the people that even just visit Craft Lake City and also the artists around me. I just connected with them as well. I, I've cross-stitched before, but embroidery is a little different, but it's a lot of fun and, and pretty easy actually, and, and it's something that I can use in costuming, which I like to do, and I, I took a lot away from it. Learning from local artists, that's, that's the best thing you can do. Um, learn from a master, you know? It's really fun to get to meet the person behind the company and the name and kind of just get to know them as a person instead of just a business. I'm only halfway done. <laughs>